Eric Ten Hag opts for emergency man United centre-back test as injuries cause havoc, as Ten Hag promotes unknown man at youngster to first team for FA Cup semi-final clash. Manchester United boss Eric Ten Hag has reportedly tested Casemiro as an emergency centre-back in training ahead of the Red Devils' FA Cup clash with Coventry. Ten Hag may end up going into the Wembley showdown with Harry Maguire as his only fit player in the position. Ten Hag bemoaned his lengthy list of injuries on Friday and claimed that he has only been able to pick from a fit squad once during his two-year tenure. Young defender Willy Camboala is the latest player to suffer an issue. There have been more than 60 separate cases of injuries and illnesses among the United squad this season. While all Premier League teams have struggled with absences, the Old Trafford side have been particularly hit in defensive areas. Lissandro Martinez, Victor Lindelof, Rafael Varin and Johnny Evans are all injured. According to journalist Fabrizio Romano, the problem has grown so bad that Ten Hag has tested an emergency centre-back pairing of Maguire and Casemiro this week. The duo are reportedly likely to start in the heart of United's back line against Coventry. Casemiro is much more comfortable in midfield, although is not entirely a stranger to playing at centre-back having been used there sparingly by former club Real Madrid. He will have the unenviable task of keeping quiet 18-goal striker Ella Sims, who has already struck five times in the FA Cup this season. The Brazilian's move into midfield also gives Ten Hag a dilemma in midfield. Safian Amrabat and Mason Mount are also ruled out of Sunday's game, although Scott McTominay's return to training this week was a welcome boost. Ten Hag may require an FA Cup triumph to save his job having all but failed in his quest for Champions League qualification. United are 13 points off fourth place to Ston Villa and seem likelier to enter next season's Europa League competition. But the Dutchman says he has no concerns over his job. He points out that a 2-1 victory over Man City in January 2023 was the only time he has had a fully fit squad. No, I don't have any concern. What concerns me is that in 18 months I have never had my favorite team on the pitch once because players were injured. That concerns me, Tin Hag argued. In fact, there was only one time, against City at home last season. That is the only time I had a full squad to pick my full team. In other news, Eric Ten Hag promotes unknown man at youngster to first team for FA Cup semi-final clash. Willie Jackson has been promoted to Manchester United squad ahead of their FA Cup semi-final with Coventry City. The Red Devils have taken a host of players down to Wembley as they prepare for the contest, which presents them with their last chance of landing any silverware. Jackson, an 18-year-old, started in the FA Youth Cup final win over Nottingham Forest two years ago and has been drafted in. Jackson is one of several teenagers to be included in the 20-man matchday squad. Harry Amass, Habib Ogunai, and Ethan Wheatley all feature, but none of the academy graduates have yet made their first team debuts, reports the men. Earlier this season, Ten Hag talked up the benefits and faith they have in the club's academy. Kabi Menu is the latest success story to come as a result of United's investment in youth as he establishes himself as a midfield regular. He said, Man United will always be a buying club, but I think history proves it gives gives opportunities from the academy if a player deserves it. It's an Arduine. We mentor them and when you give chances, they progress so quickly and bring the team to a higher level. I think we have others who can make the big steps that Kabi and Garnacho have done in the last couple of months. Injuries have stretched Ten Hag's resources and he could yet have to come up with some makeshift solutions on Sunday afternoon. Willy Kembwala, Safian Amrabat and Mason Mount were absent when United boarded their train to London at Stockport Station. Kembwala has been given minutes this term due to the host of injuries in the United backline. His absence could mean Casemiro drops back from his midfield role into defense, a position he started against Burnley in the League Cup fourth round last season. Harry Maguire is United's only fit senior center half and has traveled after returning to training on Friday. Rafael Varin, Lisandro Martinez, Victor Lindelof, Johnny Evans and Luke Shaw are all currently sidelined. Ten Hag said in the build-up to the game, we have some problems. Harry, okay against Bournemouth, he struggled. He had a small injury and he didn't train this week so far but now he is back on the pitch. We expect him today to be back in team training and he will be available I hope for Sunday. United board member Sir Dave Brailsford and Deputy Football Director Andy O'Boyle have traveled with the squad on Saturday afternoon and will be at Wembley to see the contest with the championship outfit, who are major underdogs. If you enjoyed the video make sure to smash the like button and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the latest updates.